What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another episode of Packed Out, the series where you will find me opening packs and getting a guaranteed inform or team of the season in every single pack opening. We've got a bit of a different pack opening today guys, there were some special 25k, uh, sorry, 8.5k packs for silver cards uh, to try and push the, the new team of the season that's out, sorry, yeah, team of the season that's out this week. Uh, I don't really know who the players that are in it, I, all I know is that there's Jeremy Aliadier in there and he used to play for Arsenal, so if I could get him that would be absolutely awesome. And if you guys want to purchase any FIFA Ultimate Team coins and check out FIFAcointrader.com. Their link is in the description. A very fast and reliable service. So, I don't really know too much about Silvers this year. I used to play a lot with Silvers in FIFA 11 and FIFA 12, especially in FIFA 11. The people like uh, Jobson, Ilsenio, Marlos, Fernandinho, Carlos Alberto when he was a Silver. You know, those sort of guys. Giovanni with the five-star skills used to be absolutely insane to play with and like really, really strong players with like incredible attributes. But uh, this year, the, the only team that I used that was Silver was uh, Japes 352 Bundesliga team. And although that was good to play with, I don't really know who the valuable players were. So I kept quite a few of the players here uh, that I thought might be worth a bit. I got a few um, mm -hmm. a few fast players, a few players with uh, like maybe from the Real Madrid second team or the Barcelona second team. But in general, I'm not too clued up on who the good players are and who the bad players are. But um, yeah, so we get these 8.5k player only packs. There's three rare cards and mostly silver. I do get the odd bronze here or there. And um, I opened the second set of packs. Um, well, there was a happy hour at 2 a.m. and one, I think, at 6 p.m. for the UK or 7 p.m. and 2 a.m. And uh, the ones I opened at 2 a.m., I didn't get anything good in, but uh, I did get a gold player in a couple of the packs. So I thought that was pretty decent. I managed to get a gold player. But overall, guys, there's five of these packs per person. I used one on my Xbox account and one on my PlayStation account. So I opened 10 of them all together. And the, I, don't, I don't know if the players are good. I, I know I've got a couple of good players. I've got... Um, just in the pack before I got that, I think at left back or sorry, left midfield, uh, Beasley had 94 pace. I can I only assume he goes for at least a few thousand coins because someone with that sort of pace has got to be worth uh, a bid on this game. But uh, who knows? I also got the Brazilian centre back Canu there. Now I do know that he does go for a bit, and that's the weird thing about these non-rare players is there's actually a few non-rare silvers that go for a lot more than you might think. Like Canu, for example, goes for four or five thousand coins, and if if I manage to get like Top Rack in a pack, he goes for you know like fifteen thousand coins at this stage, and they're both non-rare cards that usually people would discard. I would assume. Um, we also get uh, Rory Delap there. I kept him because he's a Premiership silver and he might go for a, a few coins. And I also managed to get um, Holt in this pack here, the left midfielder with a 3-4-3 formation. But he's got 91 pace, so the Swedish silver with 91 pace, I thought I'd keep him just in case. And that right wing there from the Barcelona second team, I thought I'd keep him too, just in case he goes for a bit. So if you guys do know if that guy goes for anything or not, then uh, it would be awesome if you could let me know. We move on to the Xbox packs, guys. Same same deal, five packs, 8.5K. And, and uh, I've only got 297,000 coins on this account. So I was hoping uh, hoping for some 100K packs in the next few days, but I don't know if they're going to be coming out or not. And uh, we've got two more Team of the Seasons left to come, uh, the BBVA and what I think is going to be a rest of the world Team of the Season. But there was also last year a Major League Soccer Team of the Season. So I'm not entirely sure exactly what EA are going to be looking to do. But they did say, they did announce at the start, that there would be eight and we have already had six so there's only going to be two left and bbva is definitely going to be one of them so we're either going to get a rest of the world or a mls all-stars um so let me know uh, let me know in the comment section guys uh, what you think the next one's going to be and uh, who your favorite player out of the team of the season has been so far if you've had any opportunities to use any of them and this is probably the best pack for me so far we've got makai steven there he's got five star skills of course and we get that centre midfielder called Traore. He's only rated 67, which usually indicates that they don't go for too many coins. But he did have four-star skill moves and a four-star weak foot, which is obviously very good in FIFA. And uh, he had a fair, fair amount of pace for a centre midfielder too. So I might look at, look at that player, see if we can build him into a team or see how many coins he goes for just to sell him. And uh, another pack, guys, and we get another pacey player, Lloyd Dyer there. Not got good skill moves, not got a good weak foot, but has got 88 pace. And again, because he's rated 67, I can only imagine that he doesn't go for too much. Ben Amos there, the goalkeeper from Manchester United. I discarded him, probably shouldn't have done. He Again, because he plays for Manchester United, he might go for a few thousand coins, and I could have just discarded somebody who was worth a fair bit to me. But uh, never mind. We do get another goalkeeper there. I think, is that goalkeeper Sorensen? It's a centre-back Sorensen, sorry. It's not a... I thought we got the... Uh, the 
Thomas Sorensen, but he is a gold card, not a silver card. But he doesn't look very good either. 62 pace for my best player in the pack, and we discard that one completely straight up. Just get a few thousand coins back for discarding the, the absolute nonsense players that we've been getting in these pack openings. Um, but, uh, you know, every pack opening does get a team of the week, and I had to go back to opening seven and a half gold 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 packs wait seven and a half k gold packs to get uh, a decent player did get a brazilian striker in this one and uh, usually when you get brazilians that are silver in the striker position you're, you're in the money especially if you get someone like uh wallison but um yeah th this guy three star skills three star weak foot really slow pace really not worth my time but to open the last pack of the episode guys the seven and a half k gold pack just to get the the team of the week that is promised for every pack opening and hopefully you can leave a like on this video for that we find a team of the week player he's not really worth too much at all but there he is i don't even know his name Griezmann, 79 rated but guys this does indicate the end of the video so if you have enjoyed this be sure to leave a like rating comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and as always thank you very much for watching and i will see you next time cheers